All right, what's going on, guys? Ghost Talk Gaming is back. It's been a couple days. I know I have been wanting to play this game for just as long as you guys have been playing this game probably already. So we are going to breeze through all this. Not breeze through this. We're going to play through this as much as we can, as fast as we can. So, again, I will be doing a lot of uh, collecting and looking around and stuff as well because uh, I am a... Big fan of the collectathons and stuff, so. See there? That's the door we need to reach. And those annoying prefects would love nothing more than to rat on us to Scribner, so don't let them see us. Understood? I can be sneaky. Let's go. Hold on now. There's a spell you should know the disillusionment charm. Good for getting places you're not supposed to be. Cast it, and you'll appear as little more than a trick of the light, just as long as you keep your distance and stay quiet. You mean I'll actually be able to turn invisible? Something like that. It's not as foolproof as a cloak, but those are expensive. And spells? Spells are free. Give it a try. All right. Disillusioned. Actually, I also have... Does he move? I hope he doesn't move. Does he move? Oh god. We're in the library! Blast. Librarian's still here. Quick, behind the bookcase. You told me the librarian would be gone by now. I said usually, but it'll still be alright. Do you see her desk behind me? The key is in the drawer of that desk. Now, here's what we're going to do. I'll create a distraction to draw her away. You focus on getting the key. I'll meet you outside of the restricted section. You distract, I get the key. Understood. I said I'd get you in, and I always keep my word. Trust me. The key. Here it is. That wasn't so difficult after all. How to find that book. Revelio. Open that, yeah. There's nothing to reveal in here other than that chest. Get out of here, no way. Oh, that one's charm to look more useful than it is. It's fooled me twice. Never judge a tone by its cover, I say. Really? Nothing? All right. Downstairs we go.
Use basic cast while undetected to allure authority figures and enemies to a desired location. Ah, okay. There's probably someone ghost. down here. Don't let her see you. Where? What ghost? Revenue. Oh, that ghost. Revive the ghost. Uh oh. Oh god. Oh god, I'm gonna get caught. I'm gonna get caught. Go over there, ghost. Yeah. Whew. Should be ready. No need for us to be skulking about. I'll be quieter than a jobber knob. <laughs> We should be clear now, is what he said. So what is it you've been looking for? I'm looking for a cure to help my twin sister, Anne, so that she can return to Hogwarts. Because Merlin knows everyone else has given up. Why do you think we'll find a cure in the restricted section? Does the Hogwarts matron have nothing that can help Anne? Revelio, we've tried everyone from Nurse Blaney to St. Mungo. But I can research on my own. No need to concern yourself with that right now. Let's focus on what you so we have gear. So you can change appearance and stuff too. I realize that. What? Oh, I'm not high enough level yet. <laughs> of course. Extraordinary. Can I change the appearance of my face wear? I really don't want to wear that face. All right, I guess I'll wear those glasses. <laughs> I just like the uh, I like the goggles defense and stuff, but Precisely. I just I'll know it when I see it. You're being awfully cryptic. I wonder if I can get up to this guy now. Oh, I can! Look at that! So now we know how to get the chests. <clears throat> Revenue. Secrets of the darkest arts. I'm impressed. I don't know what that is. That little orangutan thing looks important. I hope there's not a trophy for hitting every little... What's it called? Every little, uh... Shouldn't be. Naughty, naughty. You'll get caught. Peeves, oh, God. don't. I'm going to tell. I'm going to tell. I'm going to tell. <laughs> oh, blasted Peeves. I've got to stop him or at least get to the librarian with a good excuse for all of this. Wait, I don't want you getting into trouble for me. I have a way with the faculty when it comes to disciplinary matters. Besides, I like having friends who are in my debt. 
Now go. Good luck in your search. Now, where has that damned poltergeist got to? I know you're just... Sama. Repair. Rebellion. I don't think I need uh Lumos. There we go. Revelio. And that chest. That's gotta have something good in it. Yeah. Cerulean pattern cloak. Maybe we're uh Hopefully we can wear it. Are we Oh it's locked, of course it is. Level eleven. Whatever. We'll get to 11. We'll get to level 11 after this. So. How might this lead? Oh boy. Cinematic. Oh, or not. Surprising. Guards at the ready. A keen sense of smell. Oh. Oh, a keen sense of spell. <laughs> a keen sense of smell. Uh, that's funny. Magic, all right. the only thing I can hit, right? What the... The fuck? Alright. Forgot I could jump. This must be the way forward, but to where? Wait, what? 
probar. Why did that thing show up? die if I do this. See, you can get this chest. I just don't know how to get that one. Fingerless gloves? Stronger than those? All right. Legendary gloves. Dark Arts gloves. Ah, we're going to go with legendary gloves. I have a lot of a lot of equipment I can't wear. this place
You wanted to see me, Headmistress Fitzgerald, Professor Rackham. Miss Isadora Morganach, welcome. Professor Rookwood, Professor Bacar. We understand that you are adjusting well to life at Hogwarts. I am. I am glad. Especially in light of your unusual situation, starting as a fifth year. As it happens, I was also admitted to Hogwarts as a fifth year. I have never heard of another like us. Miss Morganock, when we spoke yesterday after class, you asked about the beautiful swirls you saw years ago when we visited your hamlet. I recognized you all immediately. I cannot thank you enough for what you did. We were glad to help. And yes, I did see swirls of magic everywhere that day. My father insists it was my imagination running wild, but it was certainly real to me. It was not your imagination. Percival, Professor Rackham can see them too, but we have never known of another who could. I don't understand. What are they? The whispers or traces that appear when a particular form of ancient magic is wielded. Ancient magic? Few are capable of wielding it. Hogwarts itself is a stronghold of ancient magic. So if I can see traces of ancient magic, does that mean I can wield it too? With the proper training. But let us not get ahead of ourselves, Miss Morganach. Before I can train you to wield such magic, you must first master all that Hogwarts has to offer. A magic this powerful can do great harm in the wrong hands. It must be wielded by a select few. As such, we ask that you not speak to anyone about what we have discussed here today. Sebastian. Sneaking in the restricted section again! I had thought we were through with this mischief. Clearly, detentions are insufficient. I'm afraid I must take this to the headmaster. But that being said, Peeves informs me that you didn't come alone tonight. If someone has coerced you, I would have you tell me. You're a bright boy. Don't waste this. There was nobody else. I came alone. Oh, Sebastian. What will your uncle say? <laughs> Not tracking any quests. No assignments. Oh, there we go. So can I just fast travel? Travel it is. Revelio. you can help me. Hello? Were you calling me? I was, yes. Oh, I thought you like might be interested in joining me for a bit of an adventure. 
following a treasure map, to be precise. Slight respite from battling the odd troll, I should think. Asked Poppy if she'd be interested as well, but couldn't drag her away from her puff scheme. I found two maps lying about, both leading to locations around Hogwarts. Care to have a look at one? Following a Hogwarts treasure map? Count me in. Wonderful! Hogwarts fascinates me. You can keep whatever treasure lies at the end of your map. I'll be satisfied just knowing where it leads. Where do you suggest I search first? Hmm... Based on a cursory review of your map, I'd suggest somewhere near Hecate's classroom. Very well. I shall take a look if I can find the time. Fair enough. Meet me back here if you find anything. Well, that's the courtyard. That's the dragon, or sorry, the rhino, up the stairs. Let's find the first landmark from Arthur's treasure map. Wait, no, that's, it's out here. Out here. <clears throat> Oh, hey, we got another math puzzle. All right, hold on. Let me get this math puzzle thing right. What's the uh, unicorn one? Seven. All right. So that one is weird spider looking. Rebellion. Oh, there's the other one over there. And the other one is seven. Cut the looking thing. Open. Yeah! <clears throat> All right. Please, please tell me, tell me we can wear that. Yeah, we can. I'll take it. We have to find the first clue, and it was in the purple. Oh, there's. Take that. Is it outside this room? Rebellion. I'm missing something up here. Professor, do you have time to chat? Oh, no. I always have time for my students. How may I help you? I wondered if I might ask how long you've been teaching at Hogwarts. Well, it's been what now? <laughs> Seven swift years. Time does fly because we have fun. Essential in my opinion. An eager, positive and confident mind is the most open to knowledge, I find. Some of the professors may not agree with your approach. <laughs> well, each of us has our own style, I suppose. Some in the teaching field believe that hard work and dedication are the only keys to success. But they forget what drives those things. If one cannot fathom why some would expend energy on gobstones, then one is blind to the enormous power of play. And that's why you teach the way you do? Precisely. I strive to be the sort of professor that I would have enjoyed in school. My experience was less cheerful. 
I'm sorry to hear that, sir. It sounds as if your experience as a student was less than ideal. Had I received a more traditional education, well, <laughs> enough about my student days. You are here now, and it would be a shame if you didn't enjoy it. I'll do my best, Professor. Thank you for the advice. You are most welcome. <laughs> uh, try to have a bit of fun today. Huh? I think I've pet that cat already. Oh my god, there's so many cats! Look at all the cats! Anything important over there? Nothing. Uh, is there a chest? Hey, yeah. I haven't learned anything yet. I'm trying to figure out... That purple... That's a lock. Handy resource indeed, your field. Maybe it's downstairs. It's probably downstairs. I see that I know where the the bone the bone dinosaur things are. What is this? Hufflepuff's bathroom. Heck, it's wait. This is a quest, isn't it? Yeah, this is a quest. All right, let's begin the quest. Cannot be serious. Goblins working with rookwood makes no sense. It is rather unorthodox, to say the least. Unorthodox? It's inconceivable. It's. Ah, Fig. You have a visitor. I'll see what I can find out. Hmm. Sir, I was able to search the restricted section while you were with Professor Black. It was a book we were after. the restricted section but how thinking on it perhaps it's best you spare me the details fair enough in fact the book was below the restricted section as it appeared on the map I want to hear everything first let's have a look Pages seem to be missing. It appears someone has got to the book before us. Still, I will need time to study what remains. Perhaps we can still salvage something useful, though it may take some time. I wonder why it was here, below Hogwarts. I think I know, sir. I saw two more memories where I found the book. Another pensive, Godric's heart. The man we saw before, Percival Rackham, was a professor here. The first memory showed him and three other professors using ancient magic to restore a hamlet from a drought. Miriam was right. And the second memory? They were talking to a student who started as a fifth year, like I did. She could see traces of magic too. Why those memories? Hmm. 
Perhaps this book will explain. Now I'll have to take it with me to London. The headmaster has insisted that I speak directly to the minister about George's death. What will you tell them about Mr. Osric's death? I don't know how much I dare say. George tried to convince the Ministry about Ranrock, but to no avail. My instinct is to follow the path we are on for the moment and keep the details to ourselves until we know more. I understand. I'll see what I can learn about the missing pages while you're gone. <clears throat> Good. Don't neglect your studies. Your wand work is improving by the day. But you'll want to pay attention in herbology and potions. There's more to magic than spell casting. Plenty to keep me occupied while you're gone. You've done exceptionally well. I look forward to seeing all that you've accomplished when I return. Oh, and don't neglect your friends. You may be surprised by how much you can learn from them as well. Yeah, don't neglect the friends. Did we get... Oh, we're not quite level 11 yet. All right. Well, if that's, uh, we'll hold off here. Appreciate you guys watching. Uh, it was a bit of a short stream. I'm going to go get some food and stuff, but I may be back, uh, in like an hour or so to Meet me in play. Meet oh. as soon as possible. I would like to talk to you about Rookwood and Harlow, and it might be best to do so outside of the castle. Cool. Professor Fig right. and Weasley have asked that I teach you an additional defensive spell. Please complete the assignments I have given you, and then proceed to see me in my classroom. All right. See you all next time.